All right, so as you saw, we compression tested the motor. Everything turned out to be all right besides cylinder three, which was a little lower than the rest. Um, but now, the adapter for the compression tester is stuck in cylinder four. Um, I'm gonna do some research, see what I can find in order to get it out, and I'll let you know because apparently this is fairly common, so I might as well make a video on this as well. Um, like I said, I'll look up some things, so if this ever happens to you, you know what to do. So in order to get the fitting out, I got some JB Weld Quick Weld, so I'm gonna mix it up here, throw it on the end of this hose, We're gonna let it sit while I take out the injectors and then hopefully it comes out. So let the JB Weld sit, so let's see if this comes out with the adapter. And it worked. Look at that. Cool. So now we know how to get an adapter out of a block. So it worked using the quick weld, JB Weld, and letting it sit for, it said six minutes to set, but I let it sit for a couple hours. Took the adapter right out. So I'm glad that worked. So for anybody who has this problem as well, um, I hope this quick video will actually help you get this done because. The videos I found on YouTube didn't help me whatsoever and I had to do quite a bit of research just to find out to do this. They also said you could use super glue, um, but I'm assuming this quick weld, JB Weld, I'll be able to take these apart so I don't have to throw out a perfectly good compression tester because an adapter got stuck. So hopefully this helps and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.